sixth grade me walked into the room. Hot air blasted my face. Computers burned away, running high demand games, monitors scalding as it refreshes the screen 60 times per second. We had about 15 minutes of break time every day. I chose to spend it here. The power button was pressed and the screen lit up. I navigated my way to Pop Tropica, a standard 2009 game, and logged in. However, I noticed everyone else shifting towards a different world. A world of Dark Orbit. Now, Dark Orbit was a game that was different from the rest that I played. Dark Orbit is a massive multiplayer online role-playing game or MMORPG, and people I interacted with on a daily basis played as well. We could communicate in real life and talk about strategies and problems we face. Gravitating towards it, I peered behind the back of an 8th grader blowing up ships and collecting ore. My eyes grew wide. I rushed towards another computer and quickly registered. And for a while, it was the game that I played, all the way until 7th grade year, where it all came crashing down. Here's what happened. No one threatened me, I didn't see anything I wasn't supposed to, nor did someone hack my account and delete everything. However, the story of Betrayal molded me into the gamer I am today. It started off just like any mission, collecting some ore, destroying some ships, maybe battle some enemy clans. Just then, a huge ship came behind me. It was the 8th grade from school. He said, hey, want to come to Sector XDF211 with me? There's some cool stuff out there. I fiercely typed back, okay dude, and tagged along with him to the most dangerous part of space. My eyes dodged around, looking for threats until another 8th grader from school beamed near us. I happily greeted him, but he stayed silent. In an instant, he opened fire on me. Shocked, I looked to my compatriot to help me, but he joined in and made mincemeat out of my inferior ship. Months of work, reduced to nothing in seconds. All for the lol's end. However, that didn't stop me from playing. I continued to get back where I was, but the computer started to slow down and freeze. My parents grew frustrated and blamed my game for this. They told me to stop. I voiced my displeasure, protecting the game like an addict. But the writing was on the wall. I forgot about my time with Dark Orbit until taking my creative writing class. Then the flashbacks came back. We paint nostalgia as a time we want to go back to, although nowadays, really looking back, maybe that isn't such a good idea. 